Hey everybody, uh, this video I've got an American 1100. Uh, I got this without a key. Um, I have picked it before and I made a key. Uh, it's 21251 bidding on it. And I'll uh, see if we can pick this guy open. Um, we got a um, 40,000 pry bar and a 25,000 hook. And plan is to put tension on it and lift pins to the shear line until it opens. That'll be our plan of attack here. I'm going to put this into a false set. And I believe it was two that did that, but... So, one hasn't really done anything. Ooh, I thought it was open, but it wasn't. The counter rotation on one, so um, I would think it's just going to be hung up on one not number one but one pin. So um, I've got the luxury of having the key go all the way to the shortest pin here, or one of them, which is number five, all the way in the back. And that was it. All right, so let's see if we can gut this guy. key for it, so we'll go ahead and lock it back. So this lock, the way the bidding shakes out on it, is we're going to have one serrated key pin, which is uh, in chamber four, which is a five pin. The ones and the twos don't typically have any serrations on them. And then we'll go into the top here. Number one shot out at me, which is a spool. Two, I believe, would be serrated. It is. That's because that's the one that put me into the false set right there. Three is a spool. Four is serrated. And five is going to be a spool as well. That was the last one before it popped open. Okay, and then springs here. I'm just going to probably have normal 
Every day, one of the mill. American Springs. single pin picked here and focus there we go we got spool number one serrated in spool in one serrated in two spool in three serrated in four and spool in number five and that, ladies and gentlemen, we'll do it for this video, and we'll talk to everybody later.